Biggest days of the year today, the final week of the regular season of high school football. And tonight, we're taking a look at one of the county's biggest rivalries. 23ABC Sports Director Stephen Hicks live at West High School tonight, where Bakersfield High is ready to take on uh, Liberty High School. So uh, how's it going out there, Stephen? Yeah, Tim, it all comes down to this. The final game of the regular season, and it will decide the Southwest Yosemite League. This field right here at West High School between Bakersfield and Liberty, it's a true title game. And in recent years, it's really become a true rivalry. But all of the history, all of the players over the last five, ten years, doesn't come close to the history and the passion found at oh, Shafter Wasco. Where else can you find this? A lot of trash talking. A lot of booing, a lot of heckling. It means everything, really. For two high schools, there's really just one game. I don't see us losing this year at all. I, there's no chance. One game that transcends high school football. It's always in the back of your mind. You know, it's it's a rivalry. It's the biggest game for our town. Tonight, Shafter and Wasco will clash on the gridiron for the 90th time in their history. This morning. If there are other exchange rallies anywhere in the country, you'd be hard pressed to find one as passionate. We have the entire city of Shafter and the entire city of Wasco. The whole community, both communities are all just for one team. With Wasco the home team at this year's game, they played host to Shafter football, cheer, and ASB. Now, there's a lot of city pride about it, and so it goes deeper than just the football game. After they traded cheers and jeers, they switched places. We hop in a bus and we go to Sheffield and we walk right into the you know, enemy territory into the gym, hostile. Their whole school's waiting for us. For the players, the nine mile ride south provides a moment to grasp the weight of a game that will be talked about and remembered for years. For just the community in general, it's just like, yeah, the everyone, team is the heart of the community. Yeah, everyone guys around us. When the team arrives, Shafter is ready. Both teams are led by first year coaches at their school. Mike Rowland hoping to extend the Tigers' win streak to 10. Shafter alum Gerald Perucci looks to bring back a general pride not felt in almost a decade. It's bigger than just a rivalry, it's a way of life that these two schools wouldn't change for the world. So one town will be ecstatic tonight. The other will be counting down the days until the next big rivalry game. As for tonight's game between Bakersfield and Liberty, we'll have highlights and post-game reaction tonight on 23 FNL starting at 11:14. But it's here at West High because the Drillers, of course, don't have a home the rest of the year. But as for those Vikings, they're traveling up the mountain to Tehachapi tonight. That is another huge game because, of course, Steve Denman, the coach of the Warriors, is just a win away from win number 300 in his career. If he gets it, he'd become just the fifth coach in the state of California. To hit such a milestone. Highlights of post game from that game as well. So much to get to. Do join us for now live at West High School. Stephen Hicks, 23 ABC Sports.